natural processes that create a storm as the air lifts and heats, it's that same process that we're trying to find in the form of thermal so that we can lift up off the ground. Oh, what does paragliding feel like? It's amazing, it's like a dream. The neat thing about paragliding is there's no motors, there's no ulterior means of, of flying. It's just you and a piece of fabric and some string. And to be able to take that and climb up as high as the clouds and fly with them is an experience that you just can't describe. power of the sun and the wind and the canopy over your head and you're climbing at this rate that is just astonishing. I mean, it's amazing. I love getting up in the mountains and flying high in the mountains. I love the feeling of taking the paraglider and using it as a tool to come from one end to another end of the mountain range to really get some distance. When you're flying, you're totally in the moment of what you're doing. And I think for anyone who has a desire to just get a different perspective on life, paragliding is probably a good way to do that. So one of the things that I really enjoy about paragliding is it's this amazing sensation of overcoming gravity, or at least being on equal terms with it. I really like the adventure of paragliding, all aspects of it, the hiking, the climbing, the flying, the, the decision making, I'm not really in the big long distances or acrobatic flights, I like the adventure of it. Yeah, I think there's a few pilots that have uh, really been instrumental in my flying career. You know, everything from my first instructor to the friends I fly with now, I've always been able to learn so many things from them. But the great thing about the paragliding community is everybody is so involved, so willing to help each other, and so interested in each other's um, safety and enjoyment. Paragliding can be a dangerous sport. Um, like anything else, there are risks involved, but it can also be very safe. It's, it's as safe and it's as dangerous as you make it. It's a kinetic exercise, but it's also a hugely intellectual exercise. And somehow, combining the two is just sublime. From the moment I did the first south side flight at the point of the mountain, like I knew there wasn't going back after that. And your feet, the second they leave the ground, I don't care who you are, there's that moment of thrilling excitement. There's just nothing quite like that feeling. It's really quite addictive. For me, it's about 
flying another day. I want to do this really for the rest of my life. It's just something very special. There's just nothing else like it on this planet or above this planet to be able to go up there into an area where we don't belong as humans and to be able to experience it and experience it like the birds. It's something that's very special.